everyone, welcome back to the next episode of Talk Hustle Transit. I'm here on the drag at the UT Dean Keaton Station. Today's guest is Evan Smith. He's the co-founder and CEO of the Texas Tribune and the Troop Fest. We're gonna hit the 803 and go up to Taco Deli, but before that, we're gonna go in and tour his studio where he does his work at PBS. Let's go, another episode of Talk Hustle Transit. Evan, how you doing? Good seeing you. So we uh, meet typically the guest and the guest's entourage sure. at this freight elevator. So you're saying some very important people have come on to this no, thing. No, with no you. the most important people. Yeah, I'm right. the least important person who comes <laughs> on this thing. So we typically get off this elevator, walk down the hall here Excellent. to what used to be the green rooms, the dressing rooms for Austin Sea Limits. That is. Like, so you are like walking cool in the footsteps of history right yeah. here. So this is actually a selection of some of the shows we've done. President Obama, Colin Jost from Saturday yeah, Night Live, yeah, right. uh, Deepak Chopra, yeah. Sonia Sotomayor, Supreme oh, Court Justice. That's a pretty big one. And the guest comes in and typically is like, look, what are you going to ask me? And I'm like, I'm not going to tell you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Never give them the questions in advance. Just like I'm not going to Are you going to give me the questions yeah, yeah. in advance? I will tell you it will be involved in tacos. This here's a 60-foot articulated bus. Yeah. We carry 11,000 people a day. 11,000. 11,000 and we share the lane with other cars. So what we're Project Connect is all about is how do we get dedicated space? Dedicated bus lane, right? 100% the whole way with real stations. I've been in Austin long enough. This is a huge improvement of what used to be. No question. So what are we gonna do here for lunch? What are the best? Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna have a Heather. Good. And I'm gonna do a Space Cowboy. Hold on, corn or flour? I'll do both corn. That's fine. What you created is like so unique and this amazing model. Knowing that we were able to figure out how to make this work, not only to do the journalism, but to also make the economics of it work. Yeah. So we're a nonprofit. We raise money from individuals, foundations, and corporate supporters and wow. enable the building of a news organization from the ground up. We have the largest newsroom at a state capital of any news organization for profit or nonprofit in the entire country for the sixth straight year. Tell me about TroopFest. And so what's cool is this year, Cap Metro's being your official transportation Love that. sponsor. We'll get everybody from point to point. Point, point, exactly. We'll, we'll get people on the bus. So this is the ninth year that we'll have done this Ideas Festival. That's what it is. It's an Ideas Festival. It happens over three days. A really great weekend of smart conversations on big topics. Yeah. We got some tacos. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, taco okay. time. Who's got the Heather on corn just to I do, thank you. It's yeah. going to be dynamite. Cheers. Cheers, tacos. Cheers. All yeah. right, good. That's a good taco, right? It's awesome. Hey, back, back to Trip Fest for a second. So you're doing a panel on transportation uh, uh, tomorrow. What do you think that you're like the main things you're kind of exploring on that? I certainly think we'll have a discussion of technology. You talked earlier about the app that users of public transit in Austin have available to them to determine when a bus is coming yeah. or to pay, yeah, pay to get on a bus. Yeah. Those options did not exist just a couple of years ago. And transportation done well is actually urban placemaking. Yeah. So you use transit to connect people to things, to learn and grow and interact and have diversity of thought. Yeah. That's what society's all about. You're a busy guy. I love the opportunity how I got to take the ultimate interviewer and make you the interviewee. I, I thought you did fine. You know, if this whole bus thing doesn't work out, you may have another, <laughs> you may have another career. Thanks again for being on Talk Coast and Transit. And until next time, we'll see you on board.